Hey, I'm Jeff Kolosinski, brand manager for Humminbird. We're here at the boat show and we got some really cool things for spring. Watch this. This is an entirely new system from Humminbird. It's our Ion series. It is a cross-touch interface and what that is, it's a fully multi-touch system that allows you to navigate menus quickly, get at things that you need to get at, but when you're out on the water and the waves are rough and things are rocking, Sometimes it's not as easy as we'd like to do touchscreen, so we have a cross-touch interface where we can come over and select all of the things that we need to do through a keypad in the same way we can through the touchscreen. One of the things that sets the ION series apart is how easy it is to use. Watch this. It's a multi-touch display with two fingers going straight down on the screen. It takes me to my home screen. On here, I have all of the icons of the things that I use most often as a captain. For instance, I'll scroll down Everybody uses nav data. We put that over to the bottom left to make sure it's easy to access. Up here, under nav data, I've got all my waypoints. Not only that, but the ION system allows me to group my waypoints. I've got some things when I go on charters, those are the, the places I go to. When I go to dive, there's a good wreck. I just call it good wreck, right? That's my secret spot. I can categorize those in groups so I can get at waypoints collectively easily when I need to. The ION system home screen has all of the features you need in smart groups so you know exactly where to get at them. For instance, settings. I can tweak my unit as much as I could ever want. I just touched that on the touch screen, but I'm gonna go back using the keypad. That's the cross-touch interface that Ion brings. I've got alarms, I've got views. As a matter of fact, here are all my favorite views. I can make more than 40 favorite views if I like. Here's how easy it is to make a favorite view on the Ion system. I'm gonna to simply touch the view button, it opens up. I go to the bottom, I hit the next key, new view. I've got a template and I can choose whichever one I like. This one, <clears throat> we're gonna go looking for bait today. So I'm gonna set this up how I would go and find bait. I'm gonna use that system. On top here, I wanna go side imaging. I wanna lay that in there and I'll tell you why in a minute. I definitely want 2D sonar so I know what the bottom's doing. And there we're going to go over a small wreck. So I'm going to use down imaging, okay, right there. Those three technologies, I'm going to save that as a favorite. And now it will come up in my scrolling menu and watch this. Right there it is with a big gold star. So on my home screen, I have my favorite bait arrangement of technologies. So if I'm going to go out, watch this. Right there is a giant bait ball scrolling off the screen, there it is on down imaging, and there it is on side imaging. I'm gonna stop the screen for a second, okay? Now, that bait ball, I know because I'm using Humminbird side imaging, is off to the right-hand side. Probably about 25 feet, so I know that's where I'm gonna need to throw the net. If there's something down there, and look, there's just a ton of bait here, and then there's some actual fish on them. I can come here, if there's a wreck that I'm on, I can mark a waypoint right there on the screen. It is just that easy. Now, if I found a little wreck or some kind of live bottom or something that's holding bait, I know exactly where it is and I can come back to that every time. It's that easy on Humminbird's Ion.